Hello and welcome back to Chronos Plays Pokemon Fire Red the Nuzlocke Challenge. Thank you for joining me. So, last time I got, you know, HMO3 and HMO4, but we couldn't use Strength to move this because we didn't have anyone in our party that could move it with a well, learned Strength. But now we do. Clubber's back in the group. Um, he's going to stay around for a little bit longer. Who did I get rid of? Um... We got Blaze, Hillbilly, Weed, King, Ryujin, and Clubber. So we get rid of Pup, which is understandable. He wasn't that good. And we get rid of Dig Dug, because in the next area we're going to, we don't need Cut. Which is really good, because he's a shitty Pokemon. Now, we're going to go back to Saffron City, because we have some Team Rocket, uh, Rocket stuff we got to deal with. At the Silthco headquarters. We also have to beat that gym. Um, and that will be difficult. Sabrina's always been sort of difficult because she's a psychic type, and in Generation 1, she was very overpowered. But we can't get in there yet. Don't get def what? <laughs> okay. And then we have the, uh, yeah, this is the rail gym over here. This is Saffron City Gym. And this is the Fighting Dojo. Now... We can go in here right now and fight all the martial artists or the karate masters and gain some levels with our psychic type. Hell, we could gain levels with pretty much any one of these guys, I think, except for King, because I think Poison is weak against fighting, maybe? I don't know. But Ryujin's also extremely weak, so I say we go to Silthco headquarters and we fight all of Team Rocket there, gain a few levels. And we will be spending some time in this building because it is 11 floors long. It has telepaths, which is ugh, ugh. And a lot of trainers. At least, I think, they at least have like two, four or three or four per floor. Um, and they're not all, you know, the same type. Excuse me there. I, I do have maps because... I am not going to know the telepads off the top of my head. Um, what we do want to do is we want to get up to the fifth floor where we'll get the key card. Now, floors one through five, you know, we'll be going up the stairs normally. Um, I'll probably go up normally all of the floors to save myself the problems of the telepads. Because they aren't very easy to understand. I mean, there's... I'll get all the treasures here that I know about. I know there's a bunch of secret treasures here. Um, so I'll get all of those, but... I'm probably going to do that after I defeat all the Team Rocket people. That way, I can mess about... Even fast forward and show you guys just how to get there. Or just cut out a bunch of stuff. Show you how to get all the treasures, what all the treasures are. Without having to worry about killing all these trainers and their Pokemon. Yes, yes, now I'm killing the trainers as well as their Pokemon. Instead of just their Pokemon. To be honest, I don't even know if this episode's gonna go up because I am recording it in the blizzard of 2013. They're calling it Nemo. It's stupid. Um, there's about six or seven inches outside right now. It's not that bad. I stayed home from work, so I've been going out every two hours, three hours, and shoveling a little bit. So, I... I spend more time shoveling throughout the day, but it's pretty freaking easy because it's just me pushing the shovel along because it's so um, thin compared to everywhere else since I've been doing it every few hours. Now that's the way you shovel, in my opinion. It also gets me off my ass. I was planning on doing um, Skylanders episodes this weekend, but I don't know if I'm going to have power. Because that... Oh, lights flickered. Hopefully the computer didn't flicker. I do have a nice warm hot cup of tea, because I did just get in from outside. You goofed? Oh, that's sad. Okay, sure it will. Oh, shit. So... Some of the scientists here are gonna fight you. Not all of them, though. Some of them don't... Or just regular Silthco employees. Others are Team Rocket people in this guy's. I guess I'll use a Psychic because I don't know how Psychic type affects. Not very effective to the Stale type. 
Okay. Hmm. What is fire? No. Wait. What do you have? Do you have Dragon Rage on you? I think you have Dragon Rage. You have Twister. Alright, you know what? What level what level is that Magnemite? Twenty-eight. So you shouldn't be able to kill him in one shot. We'll bring Ryujin out. We'll use Twister, see how that does. Wow, that did decent damage. Shit. Alrighty then. Let's get out Blaze because he's 13 levels higher than this guy. Oh, but Blaze is flying type, isn't he? I got Sonic Boom. Ah, uh, don't don't be douchebag, Magnemite. Don't be douche. And Blaze, you fucking whore. Look, motherfuckers. Well, <coughs> let us get King out, because he's immune to electricity attack. Yeah, damn right it doesn't fucking work. I don't know why I didn't think about this earlier. Let's use thir Surf, because why not, right? Seem to do a decent amount of damage to him, or at least quickly. Yeah, I spread that experience out real good. Voltorb, fuck you. I'm keeping King out. You know what? We're gonna dig on you, Voltorb, too, because I want this to hurt. I want your children to feel this. Wait for it, and penetrated. How'd that feel, huh? Little douchebag. Alright. What's next? Magneton. Hopefully he only has Spark. Do they have the levitate ability? They probably do, but let's try dig. Actually, no, I don't think they do, because I, I remember people are just like, why the hell don't they have the Levitate ability? And they don't. Sweet. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Now, I have some healing to do. Now, there is a healing place on the ninth floor that you need the key card to get to. Um, but we're not going to get there for some time. No, I don't want repels. I want heals. We're gonna heal Blaze up. Just a tad. And we'll use the Paralyze Heal on him, just in case we actually want to use him in combat. Chances are we're not, but... He's always viable. And that other Team Rocket's probably gonna have the same type of Pokemon that... The other Team Rocket dude had. I got a sip of my drink here. My throat's getting kind of meh. Okay, so he has a Ground-type Pokemon. Why the fuck not? Why don't I remember that? You Psychic on him. Granted, it has been a while since I've played this game. I guess that makes sense if they, they go by the Lavender Town logic where uh, they were kidnapping Cubones and killed uh, Cubone's mother, right? Does that make sense? Uh, I, don't, I don't think so, actually, but... Whatever. Now, that, that might be it for trainers on this floor. Let's see. Oh, there's one down there, but we can't get to him because he has the key card thingy. Alright, let's go up a floor. And there's a Team Rocket, dude. Probably has a poison type, right? Maybe? Zubat? Zubat? Please, Zubat. Now, my maps don't actually show, like, items where items are. Oh, it's Eradicate. That's like a Zubat. You know, it doesn't show me where items are or where um, trainers are. So I have no idea 
where exactly these trainers are. I know there is, I don't know how many they are per floor either. Um, but I do remember there being like three or four per floor. Now some of them are going to be hidden. Okay, let's use blaze for this. Uh, now some of them are going to be hidden by like uh, the, the key card doors. So I won't always be able to fight every trainer on the floor until I get the key card, which is on the fifth floor. So we're like two floors away. Because the first floor actually didn't have anything, so we're actually on the third floor now. I think it just said second floor a couple seconds ago. But no, we're on the uh, third floor now. Another uh, eradicate. Yeah, sure. I could. Oh, damn it. I could bring out Clubber. How does normal do against flying? Let's find out today. And critical, please, 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 please. Yes, I love you, Blaze. You are the best starter ever. Right next to Squirtle, who we'll never see. That's right, I can run here. Trainer, any trainers? Nope. All right. Item, and probably that guy. Let's move on up to the fourth floor. The deluxe apartments in the sky. <laughs> Alright, so there's a trainer. Do I need a heal? That nah, should be good. Hey, an item, sweet. Please have a poison type. You do, I love you. I mean, the Team Rocket Pokemon type usually just consists of, like, poison types, like, Coughings, Weezings, Ekans, you know, Arbox, later, later on in the game, Zubats, Golbats, and, like, Rattatas and Raticates. Cubones are pretty much very uncommon, and I think that other guy had, a, like, a Hypno as well, so, again, uncommon for Team Rocket. Definitely don't remember that. But they're nothing compared to us and my amazing lineup of Pokemon. Hey, Cubone. Guess I should really pay attention to what Pokemon he's using, right? I think I'm just going to be able to one-shot all these ba uh, bastards, but no! Chances are they'll probably eventually start putting up more of a fight. And I do have to be careful... Torment. Oh, I got some torment for you. I do have to be careful because we're still a few ways, a few floors off before that healing station. There's a team rocket dude. That's surprising, right? Now we do have to be careful with those um, scientists coming up because they have mostly electric type Pokemon. Machop. Interesting. They can paralyze us, so we don't want to use Blaze. We want to use King when they send out... Oh, huh, Drowsy. Let's get Blaze out here again. Uh, we want to send out King when they send out a Electric-type Pokemon. That way, we stand a better chance of being immune to one of their types of attack. Lights stop flickering. We're almost done with this episode. Bastards. Yeah, they expect us to get, like, 12 to 18 inches... Massachusetts is going to like 18 to 24 inches. That's, uh... That's not something I want to deal with. So I hope it does not happen. Let us move up to the... What are we... Actually, we're going on to the fifth floor. Sweet. We'll get the key card and then we'll call it an episode. So we won't fight that guy just yet. There's a scientist dude. We want to get king. Lights. Don't fuck with me now. I like the little beaker thing. Oh, you're starting with the Magneton. Alright. We'll see how he handles my dig. Now, if I remember correctly, 
I know where to find this key card. Oh, Jesus. And hopefully we'll be able to defeat the trainer that's supposedly guarding it. And, and, just maybe, end this episode before the power goes out so I don't lose it. And hopefully it gives me time to actually save my game before, you know, my power goes out. That way I won't have to re-record, well not re-record, but replay all of it. Because chances are I'll do something different and one of my Pokemon will likely die. <laughs> I don't want that to happen. Came close. Ryujin took a lot of damage from that spark. I was not expecting that. Because I, 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 Dragon type shouldn't be weak against Lightning. And it wasn't. I guess just Ryujin's pretty weak right now and I forgot to switch out. So, Psychic. This is not very effective against Steel, is it? No. That is right. I completely, completely fucked that up. Well. Sonic Boom. Thankfully, he's a lot lower than me, and paralyzed and screw me over. I will have to heal him up a little bit now, and cure his paralysis. I had a weird name. What was the name? Yo, Biar. I'm not really good with like weird names. So it goes to show how crappy my uh, reading usually is with JRPGs, because a lot of those motherfuckers have weird names. Okay, let's. There's a scientist who looks like he's on crack. And there's another Team Rocket, so we'll use this teleporter. Go fight that guy, but I'm not gonna do that right now. I heard a kid was wandering around. Damn right we were, motherfucker. I don't know why I sound Texas right now. Or Texan. I don't sound like, you know, state. Just a stereotype. Now, if I wanted to do my stereotype for my state, I wouldn't be pronouncing my R's. I'd be saying, like, wicked. Or, or pissa, or ka, chowda. But I don't do that. You know why? Because not everyone from New England does that. Just like not everyone from Texas sleeps with their cousin or sister. Okay, we know that one's kind of true, but don't worry about that. There's our key card, so I am going to end the episode here today. Before my power goes out. And I'm actually going to save right here. I don't want to lose the progress I just did. So thank you for joining me. If you liked the episode, press the like button below. If you haven't subscribed yet, I highly recommend it. And if you have any comments or suggestions, feel free to leave them below. And I will see you all next time. Have a great day. Bye.